Hey folks, this is the station where we drink beer and we review a video. Today we are branching out. Yes. We have a reggae song and uh, we're going to be reacting to that. We've never heard it or seen it before. Yep. And then we got some kind of a beer. Triple C's Golden Boy. And it goes with Alpha Blondie because, hey. I was going to so point at the beer, but we don't have we it. We don't have it right there. Anymore. All right. So right back. Professor and know it all. All right. We're got to start with the beer. Yeah, all right. So, guys, Triple C, Golden Boy. Um, this is a 4.5% alcohol. And uh, as it kind of entails, it is, um, this is a lager, I believe. Yes. I would guess so. Yeah, it should be the straight up. I think this is their. It says Blondie. Yeah. Hey, you like beer? Beer, Blondale. That's right, it's Golden Boy. All right, and let's get right into the pour. And as you guys look at the nice spinning beer down at the bottom, which it's actually spinning today, uh, Carolina Beer Temple actually provided this beautiful glass that we're using today. Yes, yes, yes. You can see, of course, their name is right up here. Yes. Right up here. Now I can actually point at stuff. Yes. Um, so the head on this reminds me a little bit of a soda. Yeah, it's got a lot of larger bubbles in it. It's not like pillowy. Um, see, it looks more like true, like a foam, you know, all the way around. Um, little crater at the top. Nice light. Yeah. Nothing, almost like a, you know, like very clean smell. Very clear too. Um, not super hoppy, very, you know. And this is what you would call smell. effervescent. Yes, yes, you yes. get a little bit more effervescence in this, a little bit more bubbles coming up to yeah. the top. Not a lot, not like a seltzer or anything like that, but let's give it a shot. I was already way ahead of you. You know what, so we've had so many like crazy flavored beers. To have a beer that's considered like a normal beer, yeah. <laughs> it's kind of like we did this and we did it with the Dream Chasers as well. It's like, wow, this is like the beer you know, you want to eat a drink and beer on the summer, yeah. in summer? This is it. This is a nice light beer. And I like it better than Dream Chasers. Like, uh, it, there's no, any, it's not too boring. Right. It's a good drink. I'll have more to say about it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I wanted to decide right. too. Quick. So, that gets us over to our video that we're watching today. So, we got, uh, let's get over to our video reaction page. And, Professor, what we got? So, this is a reggae artist called Alpha Blondie. Ah. He's from the Ivory Coast, and I this was interesting to me because he has someone work with him called Stone Boy. Huh, boy. Yeah, and he is apparently, I had to look this up, he is okay. apparently a Ghanaian star, and he's won a bunch oh. of awards and stuff, so I'm interested to see, Good. and those countries are next to each other, so I'm interested to see what, what they put like. out there, yeah. huh? Yeah. All right. So I've never listened to any African, I don't think, um, reggae. Mine's all come from like the islands. That's right. Man. Okay. Okay. Oh, When the power of love, 
just getting into the groove of that. So what do you, what do you, what are you thinking? Are you well, it's it? typical of a lot of. Uh, I mean, I know I listen to Alpha Blonde. I've listened to his stuff a lot before. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and it has what all of his songs have, just that really nice bass line that comes in and goes. Yeah, and it's throughout. And uh, I mean, it's very West African reggae. Is very similar to Jamaican reggae. Yeah, very similar. Yeah. But like listen have... to it, I have almost no difference in the feel to me. Yeah. So what do you think so far? I mean, we got the lyrics, I, right? So yeah, I you know, I've never been a beer, lyric person with any of the reggae stuff. Um, yeah. Don't know why, but it's more about the vibe for me. Okay. So to tell you the truth, I was watching more of the video, taking in all the scenery and the way they're kind of, you know, getting everybody on the bus to all be together, it looks like. Yeah, I'm kind guessing. Like that. I'm guessing. That's kind of what they're maybe what they're going for on this, but you know, it's it's a good vibe. It's making me actually like this beer more. Yeah, I was, it feels I was like... thinking this is a really good match. <laughs> it's a really right? good match. <laughs> it actually works really well. This might but, go down quick. I mean, it, reggae, the guitar you never expect anything out of. Of course, it's right. it's always the ding 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 ding. Well, I have to say, to it. because one thing that Alpha, if this is typical of his songs, is you get like an electric guitar solo in the song. Later, uh, so. But but overall, I mean, it's it's straightforward reggae. Oh yeah. I mean, um, that. some of the better reggae, I don't like. I like the more traditional style reggae than um some of the stuff that comes out of like uh, the stuff that came out later that was more. Dance, pop and dance yeah, mix yeah. with yeah. it. I, I if I'm listening to reggae, I'm listening to reggae, not right. whatever they bastardized it into later. But uh, yeah, awesome so far. Get back into it. I like the little kid's voice. Sounds like you're saying destroy your bombs, right? Uh, throw away your guns, bury your bombs. Oh, I wouldn't bury them because you don't want a kid to walk on it later. Um, but definitely get rid of it. Um, I don't understand that. And then the visual of him wearing NASA and American <laughs> flags gonna, is really... That's why I paused it here. I was going <laughs> to comment on that. I'm like, why is he wearing a NASA... Space suit or maybe, jumpsuit. Maybe for him it connects more with exploration. And, exploration. And work working together with other nations or eh, something. Could be. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah. Who knows? But yeah, the little kid has a little NASA suit. Yeah, too. a little NASA suit too. And then he should have cleaned his drawers before he uh yeah, the back shot those. He sat down somewhere. Alpha Blondi needed some <laughs> depends for this video. Sorry. All right, back into it. Clapton-esque guitar. Yeah, right. Really good. Legendary. Papa, 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 Papa
So Stone Boy, Stone Boy, right. Stone Boy, he's pretty good. Yeah, he is. I kind of like his vibe. He didn't have like a real heavy, definite like, "Hey, this is my style." He kind of like it looked like he was kind of leaning toward the Alpha Blondie style and kind of just rolling with it. Now I don't know if that's how he normally is, but we'll have to check out yeah, some more of his stuff. Maybe, maybe he's got some more stuff out there. Um, he also, I noticed that you noticed Alpha Blondie went first. Yes. And he took up half the song. Oh, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. he's like the elder statesman. Well, he even African said, reggae. even Alpha Blondie legend. Like, yeah, he, he said that like He calls him out right at the yeah, very beginning. Yeah. It's almost like a rap song where you have the guest rapper who says, Yeah, I'm with Dre. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> More Santana esque than Clapton. You're right. Good call. Especially here. That bridge pickup in there. That's pretty sweet. Yes, you know, that's, that's what I like about West African reggae. That was pretty freaking cool. I'm gonna be, be honest, that was uh, refreshing. You know yeah. what I mean? It was different then, and refreshing as in I drank literally two thirds of my beer. You got me beat by a lot. But yeah, they go great together. That's probably the first belch we've had on film. And considering we've done like 20 videos so far, yeah, that's pretty amazing. Uh, oh, there's a second one. All right. Not to be outdone anymore. Nope, that's it. Okay. But uh, you know how um, these uh, lighter lagers and um, uh, ales, blonde ales, kind of do me? There you go. That's okay. it. So, anyway, but, but back to the beer. Yeah. You're already on it. You know, oh, yeah, my fault. Well. That's what she said. Back to it. Oh. <laughs> um, this is a good lager. Yeah. Uh, we've been let down by some other log. Well, I can one in particular, I won't call it out. Yeah. But, uh, and this is nice and clean. I would drink more than... In fact, I prefer this to Stella. And I like Stella. Yeah. Because this doesn't have... Yeah, Stella's your Budweiser. Of, yes. And when we say that, we mean everybody in the world, first beer, they, you say, hey, name a beer. What is it? Budweiser. Not me, but normal. Any guy off the street type of guy. But yeah. Stella so has a bit butt. of a bite aftertaste that I'm not a fan of. And this doesn't have that. No. So. Not all. Like it's it very light. This is going to be a good, good. I mean, this is no wonder they have kept this rolling since they came out. I mean, this has been their yeah. baby, so there's a reason why. So Triple C, great job. Uh, mm -hmm. I'm Blondie, just to wrap back around to it because I kind of belched into the end of the <laughs> what you're talking about. But great song. Want to see some more, and I'm mean, want to see what uh, Stone Boy. Yeah, I'm interested in that because he's a newer artist. Yeah. So this is kind of like the old meets the new. Yeah. Uh, very so. cool. Very very cool. All right, guys. Well, thanks for tuning in once again. And Go see the guys over at Carolina Beer Temple. That's right. Download some Alpha Blondie. And go ahead and get out and get yourself a triple C Golden Black. All right. Yeah.